I just heard a loud boom. You, you did? Was it a plane? That's what I was thinking. It was a terrorist attack. Bob said he heard it sounded like a rocket. I heard a plane. It seemed like a plane went over. Yeah. And then I had the boom and I looked up and there was the thing exploding from the outside. Exploding to the outside. The whole... It looked like a... Your mom said there was a plane explosion. driving over, flying over the in there. I heard the noise of a plane. Oh, she, you, she heard the noise of a plane and then a boom. And then I, just like a, it was like a bomb that dropped and all the building from the inside went out like there was an explosion from the inside going out. Oh, my. I hope there was nobody at work. I hope there was no one there. That's what I'm thinking before nine. What building is it for you? It's the World Trade Center. Oh, I see fire engines. They're coming. Yeah, big one. What? My hand's shaking. I am. I'm trying to see if there's people up there. I don't see people, it's just an incredible amount of smoke. Well, the plane had crashed into there. It is spreading. There's only one fire truck right now. They're going to have to get planes and drop water onto it. Because it's so high up. Oh, uh, really? You heard some, someone talking to you, said it's a plane? Oh my god, Lily's going to daycare there. Hold on, there's call waiting. Hello? Hi. Oh my god. Do you see this? Oh, so they've got it on TV. Oh my God, I have it on.
Oh, me too. I thought it was as well. This build. Oh, you're right.
my god! Oh my god! Oh my god, what's happening? Really? I think it's all about the World Trade Center. Oh my god! It was a military plane. People are running away. Oh my god, we just saw it happen. Where's Bob? Oh my god. Babe, are you there? It's we're okay. We're okay. Yeah, they're attacking the World Trade Center, not us. Where are they coming from? Oh, from the south. From the, from the south? Yeah. In the same building you went to? Yeah. It was a huge plane. Where are they flying to? Is Babe, they're going to show it to you on here. I don't understand why they don't get like play, jet play. Building's collapsing. <laughs> oh my god, it's over! Oh my god! Oh shit. Yeah, I think we're okay. I think we're okay. No, no, I think it was the building that's collapsed. Yeah. Oh my god! Are we, are we okay? I think we're okay. Can you turn back on the new car? Oh, but did the power go off? Did we lose power? Yeah, we lost power. Um, you want me 
won't be able to call it on the phone. You can try. It's working. Is it working? Just to recap, if you're just joining us, around 8.42 Eastern time this morning here in New York City, a plane crashed into the right twin tower of the World Trade Center, about two thirds of the way up the building, leaving a huge gaping hole, a huge fire. 
and tons of billowing smoke. About 25 minutes later, a second jet, believed to be a 727 or a 737, then crashed from the second twin. All these people running away. But you know, this happens every day, right, in the Middle East? You think to yourself, how lucky we are. We've never had this horrible So true. Before. You're right. And just imagine living. Masaki went through all of this during the war. All his houses, you know, bombed. And oh, really? Oh, really? You know, this is the documentarian in me that feels like I need to oh, record yeah, this. Thank you. Oh, look at like, all the ashes. It looks like it's yeah. snowing. Mm -hmm. There's people mm -hmm. getting onto the west side now, onto the walkway. It's just all smoke. Out of the World Trade Center building. I'm just thinking People. Of the body parts, that's what I think to myself. Oh, God. Hey, guys, how you doing? Oh, my God. I'm just so sad. I know. Yeah. I'm just thinking there for the luck, you know, next week. Yeah. I'm just saying, thank you, God. But I'm just saying, as soon as you just thank God, you realize that other people yeah. are just so absolutely devastated. So it's said to forget it, you know, later on I might try and go to the hospitals. Okay. If there's anything I can do to help. I have a feeling that the only thing is that it's just going to be so hard to move around. I think you're just well, best. Just if there's anywhere I can walk to that they have a hospital. So but even, even walking around, I mean, it's just a disaster. It's like a no man's land out there. Well, I'm not going to do anything that's, you know, that adds to the misery. So I'm glad you got home here earlier. Yeah. Thank yeah. you, God. Oh, my God. You see, on the beach, did you see that movie? No. What was it? The nuclear war. Oh, God, I'm glad I didn't. It's just smoke. And we saw the whole ground, the whole building shook. In fact, our cameraman even put one of the captains in his car and drove him down to a command post. The people that you're seeing here are pretty much all emergency workers. Many of you that I've seen in the last two to three minutes, quite frankly, are coming out of here. Remember this. These are professionals. They're coming out of there looking literally stunned in shock, many of them, struggling for breath. Obviously, in serious distress, breathing problems are the biggest problem for those who manage to make it safely out of Oh my god, there's no more World Trade Center. You can't see much more than a block south of me right now. And the World Trade Center probably stands about 10 blocks south of where I am at this moment. And as you can see now, the dust is beginning to pick up here. It really depends on which way the wind blows as to whether or not we get heavy dust or not. But at this point... Ground with all the ash. Yep. 